disrespect shown toward the Prophet Muhammad sallallahu alayhi wasallam is an insult and an abuse of Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala is a slap in the face of every Muslim yet when some magazines or some papers and perhaps uh, websites circulate and recirculate offensive cartoons of the Prophet sallallahu alayhi wa sallam we, we the Muslims hardly feel a thing we the Muslims do practically nothing about it Terror in the heart of Paris Good evening from New York, I'm Chris Hayes and there's dramatic new video tonight capturing the moments just after two gunmen stormed the offices of the satirical newspaper Charlie Hebdo last week in Paris. In this portion of the video taken from a rooftop near the Hebdo offices, the two brothers, Sharif and Saeed Kouachi, have just exited the building inside which they left 11 dead and 11 more wounded. They approach a black Citroen car as one brother repeatedly shouts, quote, we have avenged the Prophet Muhammad and references Al-Qaeda in Yemen, also known as Al-Qaeda in the Arabian Peninsula. Brothers are then seen changing the magazines on their automatic weapons. They eventually get in the car and drive around a corner where they are confronted by a police car and begin firing. We watched in horror as a black man was murdered by police in the United States. Many Muslims participated in rallies and demonstrations expressing their outrage over these horrendous crimes. When something worse than that happened, when our Prophet Muhammad Sallallahu Alaihi Wasallam, the best man to have ever walked the face of this earth, was insulted and abused and accused of being a terrorist. And where are their rallies? And where are their demonstrations? Do we accept this claim by the opponents of Islam?